The most efficient way to use the orbiter is to grab the curing light, simply rotate the position of the tip to the right orientation, you go into the mouth and you cure. Most surfaces, just rotating the tip is all you have to do and the filter ends up being in the correct orientation so your eyes are protected. There are some areas frequently for interproximal restorations, all cure from the buckle and then the lingual. The filter may not quite be in the exact position I need it to be. So the technique I use is as I'm coming into the patient's mouth, I'll place my thumb on the filter and just kind of rest it on. And as I'm coming into cure, I can move this curing light tip to any portion of the tooth I'm working on. And by just resting my thumb on the filter, it keeps it rotated in position so my eyes are protected. So it's one incredibly efficient, smooth, fluid motion that doesn't require stopping and starting and grabbing and twisting. I grab the curing light or the assistant hands it to me. Or if the assistant cures in your office, he or she simply grabs the curing light. They come into the patient's mouth, they cure, they can rotate it around to whatever position they want. And as I'm doing this, this filter is rotating into position. It doesn't matter where in the mouth I'm curing, it's all happening in one smooth fluid motion. This is how using the orbiter saves you time, gains you time during the year. Our studies have shown that as many as two days a year can be gained using the orbiter compared to other forms of eye protection because of these time savings.